So I'm sure a lot of you guys have already seen the update log for the brand new type soul update. But yeah, it's pretty disappointing in my opinion. And even the weapons that we did get are pretty boring. But yeah, if you guys end up enjoying it, like, subscribe, and join my Discord down below. But let's get right inside this update log so you guys can actually see what I'm talking about. So here you guys can see, this is our whole update log. We have a universal medic weapon and a element lot sorry per weapon, which is for Berserk. But apparently, you don't even get it from Kampachi. According to Nano Prodigy's video, you get it from Plan Wars or you get it from AFK World. That is the only place that you can get it. According to Nano, Nano could be wrong, but I don't know. And then we have three codes, which give an all, all right amount of rerolls. I think you did like 75 total. You guys can see they already nerfed this Rager's Edge thing, which is kind of crazy. Um, and then they added all this as well, which is like cool. But nothing really that important. This is our whole balance patch for the update is that and this. So we have like a total of what? Seven, eight patches and then two new weapons. And that was our whole update log. This is like the quote unquote big update of the week. And yeah, we got like eight patches and two new weapons, which is um interesting. And the weapons don't even look that good. Like physically model wise, they're all right looking. But they're not really going to be meta defined. Maybe the Berserk one just because Berserk was already pretty meta. And it is a command grab crit, which looks interesting. But I don't really know. It's just a very boring update. Uh, but tomorrow, literally tomorrow alone will be better than this whole update. Because you guys can actually see. I think it's right here. Yeah. Q Keto expansion update will probably be tomorrow, which is pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. Um, Razor's Edge has its own unique mechanic where you have to land the crit three times and then something special will happen, which is also kind of cool. Then here's all the stuff for the Medic Universal. So the Twincy one, you and your party members are given a defensive barrier. It gets destroyed in two hits. That shit's ass. Two hits for you and your party members? That's not gonna do anything. Um, a wrong card is actually pretty cool. It dash and attacks your opponent and it steals Ray and gives it to you and your party members. That's pretty cool. The story per one, once again, is the most broken one. I, I don't know. I... <laughs> story pers are glazed to the max, but basically it's a slash that I'm assuming does a decent amount of damage and it procs life steal for you and your party members. So the story per one, once again, is uh, the best one, which is crazy. And once again, the Twincy one is the worst one. So that's a little interesting, but Twincy Keto expansion update will be tomorrow. If you guys don't know, they're supposed to be adding an ultra skill and like five new skills. So I actually am leveling up a Quincy. I'm going to get the Shard of Ray. I'm going to get True Blood and just go crazy. That will probably be my new build. If you guys haven't noticed, I'm switching builds like every two days because they... I, I don't even know why. To be honest, there's just so many builds that are bad. And it seems like every single build that I've made so far isn't the greatest. Like a Roncar Murasama, God, that shit is terrible. Now the Quincy Murasama might be the best variant now because the Story Per one also has been getting a lot of nerfs. Um... Yamato, the M1 speed got nerfed, and that kind of dudded it, and then speed got nerfed in general, which I just, like, I don't want to play on a dudded skill tree, I'm not gonna lie, even though speed is fun, so it seems like Keto might be my last option, so I'll be testing that out tomorrow once when they add uh, Q Keto expansion update, where they will be adding a bunch of stuff for it, that might be cool, but we'll just have to wait and see, um, if not, then I don't know, I might... <laughs> i'm bored out of my mind on this game i'm not gonna lie especially with bad updates like this recent one but yeah you guys can feel free to leave your own thoughts inside the comments on the update on the game state right now in general i will have a video tomorrow talking about the vanquish situation because that was kind of crazy as well little drama situation that i'll be uh talking about tomorrow having a little bit more info info fucking christ uh more information for you guys and on who actually did it because he did blur the name i don't know why he would blur the name uh, but yeah, you know, some shit like that will be tomorrow. But yeah, mid-update. Can't say I'm that surprised, but I'll see you guys in tomorrow's video. Peace.